A postcard is meant to memorize a shader setting, which can be used again in any of your projects. This quick exercise will reveal its advantage. Apply a new shader to the floor and make the pattern parallel to the wall. Click on a postcard icon in the upper right hand side of the inspector's toolbar to display the postcard window. Click the button to create a postcard. Remember to give it a name and save it. Once it is stored, it will remain in your postcard window for any future project. Change the material of the same surface to create a new variation to your scene. How can we return to the previous setting? If you apply the same shader to the floor from the catalog, the pattern won't be parallel to the wall. Postcards preserve your custom parameter settings for shaders saved with them and so can help you change back quickly. Clicking the icon at the lower right corner of the dialog, you can apply all shader attributes saved in the postcard to the current scene. To apply any custom shader settings from a postcard, make sure you first select it and open it by clicking the Show Selected Postcard icon. Drag and drop the desired shader from the postcard into the preview over the chosen surface. The scene will automatically refresh and display the postcard material. The inspector will also highlight the newly applied shader and the settings will be those saved in the postcard. Atlantis suggests a postcards folder by default. However, you can store postcards on your hard drive or even in a shared folder on your local server. The button on the top left of the postcard window opens and closes the drawer, displaying the list of your loaded postcard folders. You can add or remove folders to control the content shown in the postcard window. Right-click the folder name to make the contextual menu appear with additional options, check or uncheck a folder, reveal it in the folder where it is stored, or remove it from the list. Postcards are small JPEG images which are independent of projects. They are an excellent tool to share settings graphically among team members on the server or via email, as long as the JPEG file stays intact. Please note though, attributes saved with the postcard will only be applied in your projects if the corresponding shader exists in your media catalog. Explore the Atlantis postcards during your work.